This video idea was recommended to me by Bamboo Free. His channel link will be in the description of this video. You should check him out as he makes daily Skylander and Minecraft content. How's it going party people? It's your boy Skydubs back again with another legit ranking. Today we'll be ranking all 8 whirlwinds. I found only 8 of them so I will rank 8 of them. Number 8 crystal whirlwind now this is a chase variant and you know chase variants don't really add anything to the game i may have missed some but uh, as far as i've done research and this is the only chase variant that i've found of whirlwind so yeah it's number eight because it doesn't add anything to the gameplay number seven you see well she is different I'm not a huge fan of minis as they're pretty pointless in my opinion and plus she has the same exact moves as whirlwind as regular whirlwind and nothing is changed at all except her looks and you know minis are made to look cute and let's be real here she really isn't that cute so yeah she's number seven number six now you see this is where it gets hard for me because in my opinion, the Awakened Whirlwind from the Ring of Heroes has the second best design. But you know, it's a mobile game, it really isn't, you know, like her moveset. And the Awakening as well gives her that power that can heal Skylanders, which is also amazing. But you know, it's just, it has that sour taste in your mouth because it's the mobile game. So it's number six. Number five. Now for the series 2 Whirlwind while her horn that is a different color adds a little bit to design it really isn't anything special just like her wav pow which doesn't add anything special to her moveset so yeah overall i think that the number five spot is perfect for series two whirlwind number four so this is basically the same series two whirlwind and while I'm usually a bigger fan of regular Skylanders and not of variants, um, in my opinion, the Polar Whirlwind is one of the coolest variants in Skylanders history, and in my opinion, it's the best Whirlwind design. So it's got to be higher than Series 2, but other than that, it's the same as Series 2. Number 3. Now, I was never a fan of Ian's Elites, because it's just the regular Skylanders and they are too overpowered and you can only play as them from Trap Team or maybe from Superchargers. So they're basically the same Skylanders in the first three games. You can't even buy WoW Pals, which sucks. But it really is nice to play as a really strong Whirlwind because I'm going to be real with you, regular Whirlwind isn't too strong and neither is Series 2. So that's why I really like this one, even though it doesn't change almost anything from the regular Whirlwind. Number 2. This is one of my favorite series 2s, 3s or 4s. Because first of all, it improves Whirlwind's design with the crown, even though the Ring of Heroes Awakened Whirlwind did the crown better. And her Wow Pow as well improves her move style a lot. It makes her stronger. And... It's pretty good, as you can see on the screen. However, while I love all of them a lot, even though I don't have all of them, there can only be one number one. And that, of course, is the original Whirlwind. My first Skylander and my favorite Skylander. It had to be number one. While I don't think she's the best, she's my first one and I am very nostalgic towards her. And I really love her. So yeah. That is where we're going to end this list. I thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.